This week's mod of the week comes from Yotaro KitKat. Yotaro KitKat has finally released his Mega Hammer Shot Cylinder. It's a Mega Hammer Shot, and I think that's really, really cool because in some games, Megas are shield breaking. And I've been wanting this since I first saw the video on Make Test Battle. I'm Yotaro KitKat, and this is my loadout. The continuation of Mature Blaster content is ensured by these patrons. Beat the algorithm by making sure you're subscribed, by tickling the bell, and selecting all notifications. Dun, 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 dun. Who are you? What do you got? I'm Yatara KitKat, or Daniel, and this is my loadout. This is my worker swordfish vector, painted up in rainbow fabulousness. How did you get this effect? Because it just looks, it really, looks really good, really nice gradients and transitions. So I had to hang it up and very slowly just layer after layer and work my way down to get it. So it was hanging sort of like that. It took a and few so hours to paint. Is that a strife or is it oh it's a swordfish. Swordfish. Oh and you masked out the swordfish. Yep, as well. I made sure of that. I wanted to keep all the details in it. That's excellent. Batteries and motors are running. So this is a Freus Lipo running Neo Rhinos in a transparent Aurora cage, just with the basic white worker wheels. Still running uh, full length darts, but I was going to make it half length, but they just weren't performing very well. you got to do a high crush cage, and at that point you might want to go aluminium, because you'll get too much flex, right? Yeah, I wanted to make it so it was, the light would pass through it and it would keep it very flamboyant being transparent. Yeah, so. like the, the Aurora clear cage is perfect for that. Yeah, I did this actually before they released the transparent wheels, otherwise I would have gone them as well. So I was a little bit dirty about that, but it is what it is. You could just paint the wheels rainbow now. So. Yeah. Alright, so what's the rest of your rig here? Single point sling, just an eBay discount, a Mazo Factory 2x3. I recognise the quality. Yes, God rest Tom's soul, wherever he is. <laughs> no, he, he's around. He, he's alive. He's good. Ah, he's alive! Okay. Oh, thank God for that. Oh, you even got a grenade pouch. Oh, I've got a grenade pouch! I didn't even realise I had that. Oh, I like that you've got a whole bunch of like straps going over the top too. Yeah, so. at the time Mazo was doing the, the shoulder straps, they looked really good. So I like to go all matching orange, 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 and then just have a little bit of flamboyancy. So now, what is this? This is my Nerf cart, inspired by Bang Ben Mods up in Queensland. Um, I think he stopped doing Instagram stuff now, but did a trolley and it looked amazing. So mags mounted onto a plate of timber. The blasters don't bump into each other anymore in transport. And now I don't have to worry about things oh, getting so stressed. So you actually transport them on the... Yes, on just there. leave them on there. They're a little bit loose because the magwells are loose, but they won't bump into each other. I've even got sunscreen. Slip, slop, slap. Cancer kills, kids. That's it. <laughs> Pop off the retaliator. Uh, PW, PDW, a worker stock with my own 3D printed cheek, cheek rest. Oh, nice. And like even copied the same pattern that was on the back. Oh, detail. I like that. And this is my own Z Town friendly pump kit. It so is defined a... for uh, the audience at home. So Z Town is a no modification event. So this kit bolts over the original bolt sled. Ah. Excellent, so you haven't opened up the, the blaster. The blaster has never been opened. It simply integrates straight over the top. Clever. I've done most of it. Jace 3D Iron Sight, Thingiverse Picatinny pump grip, uh, grip that I found. I like the extra details of Utara. Ah, uh, have there. to, have to brand, have to brand. Yeah, and even putting Retaliator on the other side. I just noticed some extra details on this, but you're copying the old Retaliator like detail there yeah, as well yeah. that's awesome dude i love it i make an effort on this shit if it's for myself i put in a fair bit of effort that's why i went to such lengths to actually get that pattern to match the back perfectly i mean i'm just pedantic like that it's a shame if i had f found the text that matched the actual correct way to write it i would have had that in it as well right that's an interesting one what is the font of the retaliator tell yeah. us in the comments i got other versions so my younger brother which is running around out there somewhere has his version and i've also got a ret uh, retalicon uh what plunder tube is that this is stock 
This is an American spec that I picked up in Singapore, Sonic Ice Retaliator. I'm your Tara Kit Kat, and this is my loadout.